Oh my God, it's a miracle. Thank you, Jesus. This is Fan First Network. We're still persevering through the snow blowing at us here. The Leafs came away with a bizarre win, but a win nonetheless. What did you see out there? It was the best of times. It was the worst of times. You know, they, did, they didn't start on time. We didn't get anything happening until the third no, period. Chuck, you can fuck off. Last time I saw shoulders like that was on a trope. Mitch Marner did with that K. Johnny looked pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> Bro, he looked like the guys I used to go against as a kid. Like, what is it, Pee Wee here, buddy? Or what? I saw some pretty good refing. I think they made some pretty good calls at the end there. How and the fuck did they call that back? I don't know. It's Suddenly it turned into a W. I will take it. The fact that they reviewed that, they reviewed Woo! it. Yeah, we came we, away with we a win. Were getting, we were getting ready to leave, and then we're like, what's going on? Oh, my God, it's a miracle. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> I thought just maybe, just maybe, that they would call it back because of the double tap. Everyone's leaving, and they're coming back, and I was like, what? What? What's going on here? I've never seen that happen in my life. I don't know what was going on, but they called us back, and we'll take it. They don't we'll, ask we'll how, they ask how many, that's all that matters. We were flabbergasted. We couldn't believe it. Yeah. Marner and Matthews were split up today. Uh, obviously, Marner went away for a little bit in the game. What did you think of the new look lines? I think that's fine. I think I think JT needs somebody to feed him the puck, and we've, we've seen that before. And, you know, anybody can play with Matthews. So, um, yeah, you just got to get that second line going, you know, just for a little bit. I really liked it. I think he's really good with Nylander and Nice. yeah. Yes, they need to be split up. Okay. You know, you can't spread every fucking power on one fucking line. I'm just here to drink beer and have fun. So how are, how are the how are those twenty dollar beers in there, bro? They were expensive as fuck. <laughs> yes. They were expensive. This kid was up on the glass, absolute blowout. Not the game. Shit all over me. I got shit on my shirt. I got shit on my sleeve. No it's just shit. No joke. Joseph Wall, you already mentioned him. Was yeah. he your standout performer tonight? Absolutely. Easy number one guy. He, I mean, he held the fort down. Yeah, get, if he wants the shrimp dinner and the lobster, <laughs> you get him whatever he wants. Yes, you know, he, he earned it. Gregor, number yeah. 18. Hey, yeah. Man. Big goal. For Big goal from the fourth line. Yeah. Gregor. Gregor. I got to go John Tavares. He was good out there. And John Tavares doesn't get enough credit. Leafs fans are all hyped on Matthews, all hyped on Marner. Yeah. He's the captain. Yeah. Domi, God bless you. Get Reeves to teach you how to fight, cause Bud, you just got your ass kicked. And in there, one punch, bro. But, but I love the Sam Bennett. Oh, hey, I got hair, Bennett. You don't, you know. So saw Domi. You know the guy that's on the back of the jersey. I saw I, him. I saw him do what he normally does: drops the gloves and uh, gets no points. But uh, you know, I like him when he was on a better team. You know, it's been a while since this place has seen the cup, obviously, you know, so. Oh, you guys have not seen the cup in at least 25 years longer. Right, right, right. But, but like, triple Latin, you get Toronto's amount, right? Yeah, like, it's, fine. It's, I don't think you guys are ones to be talking about yeah, the yeah. about the cup draft. I thought it was all right. It was definitely the most bizarre end I've seen to a shootout uh, in a very long time. It clearly did two touches. So, like, I guess we'll take the win. A win's a win. Uh, the Leafs were not particularly good offensively. Joseph Wall was... Joseph Wall stood firm. That Absolute was, unit. Oh, uh, absolutely, man. That guy's my starter 100% of the rest of the way. Like, it's not even close. Marner and Matthews getting split up from that first line. What are your thoughts on that? Look, like, that first line, uh, the second line anyway, with Nylander and Tavares has been great all year. And JT likes to have the puck fed to him. Marner and JT, we know it works well, right? So I'm, I'm kind of happy to see that. Quarter season assessment. Yes. What are your thoughts on that so far? It has been a mixed bag so far. Like, they have obviously the offensive talent, but the defense, the holes in the defense are quite apparent. Um, Joseph Wall could probably use a little bit of additional help. Um, but, like, you know what, man? This Leafs team isn't that different than the Leafs team last year in identity, and that's a concern for me. I'm worried. That's my, my honest assessment is I am worried about this team. Yeah. There's positives in Nylander. There's positives in Austin Matthews signed for a while, but this is not a complete Leafs team, yeah, and they need thought, to figure it out. We thought bringing in Klingberg and Reeves and all these guys was going to give the Leafs a new identity, but it seems to be biting them in the ass and just making them play as the old Leafs team that we saw last season getting dropped out by Florida. Th that look – that – Leafs team that we saw play against Florida today has a few different players in it, but it really wasn't that different than the Leafs team that got eliminated in five games last year. This week. is Fan First Network.